and welcome back to my channel. So today for you guys I have another wig review and this one has a little bit of color. So if you're interested to see what I'm currently wearing then make sure you keep on watching. Alright guys, so this is another Sam's Beauty unit. Thank you Sam's Beauty for sending me this unit to review for my channel. And the unit that I'm currently wearing is by Outre. This is their Swiss lace front wig and it is the style Valentina. The color I'm wearing is DR425. This is what the stock card looks like. And of course it has all types of different colors that are available on the Sam's Beauty site if you guys are interested in checking them out. I decided to go with something a little different because I haven't done a burgundy color since probably the winter time. So I wanted to experiment with color on this one. Um, this unit does feature a 4x4 Swiss lace um, pre-plucked frontal area, so right on the top here. And as you can see, you can either part the unit differently or you can shift the unit differently. Um, the model is wearing it in the middle here and then to the side here. Um, as you can see, I don't even really have a part going on. This cap is typical. You have your two combs in the front, a comb in the back, and you do have adjustable straps as well. It is a breathable cap with soft lace. It's a nice curl pattern. I'd say this is like a 3B, 3C looser curl pattern, but it's really pretty because it still looks very natural. And the coloring is also very pretty. It's like this rich, almost like 99J, but it's a very, like a very deep magenta color. It's really pretty. If you are looking to purchase this unit, it is currently available on the Sam's Beauty site, retailing for $31.99. Now let's jump into my thoughts on this unit. So, I really like the curl pattern of this unit. I really like the length of this unit. I feel like this is another very natural looking unit as far as a curly unit can go. I really like the color too, but I'm kind of mad that I got it in this color because now I wish I would have gotten it in like a more natural color, like probably like a 4 or like a... 30 dark root 30 instead of this magenta color but this color is really pretty um if you guys are looking for a little bit of color in your life then this is definitely a good choice for you they also have other colors that you can choose from other than this one um i'm not receiving any shedding or tangling which is both very good your fingers shouldn't really be in a curly unit too much but so far i wore this unit for the last couple of days and i haven't received much shedding or tangling especially around my neck area i'm not getting any of that so that's really good and i want to share that with you i do like the parting room because it does look extremely natural i don't have my hair parted i just kind of have it like tousled and i still am really liking how it's like laying you can see the silk top through the way i have my hair flipped which i feel like gives a really realistic look to this unit I don't typically like to wear my curly units parted. I go for the flip because I feel like the flip is more natural. And I also flip my natural hair. So I might do a middle part for a couple of days. But once my hair starts to get big after day like two or three, I just opt to flip it. So it's just like this really big, messy kind of like curly look. And I feel like it looks really good. Definitely recommend this unit. I'm really loving it. I feel like it's really natural and you can get away with looking extremely natural wearing this unit. So if you are new to the wig game and you want to try something that's like curly and natural protective style, this is a great protective style, then I definitely would suggest this unit. You don't have to go for a color like this if you want like an everyday kind of unit. You can go for more of a subtle color, which is what I probably would have preferred instead of this color. But I still like it a lot. I can tell like this unit is going to last me a while and yeah, I have nothing bad to say about it. I love the volume. I feel like it looks very natural. Luster wise, it's very natural. It is a little snug, so I will throw that in there. That would be my only con is it is a little snug on my head. Granted, my hair probably isn't braided as flat as it could be, but I'm still getting like a lot of it's like a little it's a little snug, especially at the top part. I am using a comb just to kind of keep it in place because since it is a little snug, it was kind of like sliding back on my head. Um, so I just used one of the combs on this side to kind of keep it in place. But yeah, other than the fact that it's a little snug of a cap, I definitely say this is a keeper. Alright guys, so that is it. If you've made it to the end of this video, thank you so much for tuning in. If you liked this video and want to see more wig reviews slash tutorials from me, make sure you give it a huge thumbs up. That's how I judge whether or not to continue to film stuff. So make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more. 
Don't forget to leave me a comment. Let me know what you think of this unit. Also, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you are watching my videos, why aren't you subscribed? Go ahead and join the crew. I do have a few exciting videos coming up for you guys in the next couple of weeks. So make sure you click that post notification bell as well so you are notified when I upload my next video. And until then, you guys, thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you later. Bye.